<laughs> Thank you. You skipped the meal. Yeah. That's right. If we, how much do you have left? Not much. Oh. I want some more creamer. Well, yeah. uh, we just wouldn't have had the coconut cream. Yeah, that's uh, something to help because we didn't have tea. It's perfect. As I was saying, there's bold climbers and there's old climbers, but there's no old bold climbers. <laughs> if you keep climbing without a rope... Do you know about Fred Beck? Uh, you watch his movie? Oh, you like that. Um, it's called Dirtbag, the, the legend of Fred Beck. I, 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 I'll this look guy almost up. went on the Everest e e expedition with uh, Jim, Jim Whitaker, but he's so, so cantankerous, he would... He's not a, he's, he wasn't a team player, but right. he, he basically wrote the Bible um, for the Cascades, like the, the climbing routes in the Cascades. So it's our second day, slept late, had a great breakfast, and now we're headed up to Dawson Pass and then back down. Unfortunately, uh, Old Man Campground is closed because of bear activity. So we'll be headed back down to uh, No Name Lake. Does he know you're here? There's no way he doesn't know you're here because he looked at y'all coming up. I mean, there's no way he doesn't know I'm here now. He came from about a hundred feet down and just kept coming up this way. We're headed up to the pass in this direction. We're probably about, oh, three quarters of a mile, maybe less from it. Awesome. Oh, that's still a lot. It's a pretty steep climb. 
It's not too bad with these poles. Did you tell him about the bear? Oh, no. <laughs> This is Dawson Pass, and as far as you can see, there are mountain peaks surrounding us in every direction, 360 degrees. this edge here. Wow, that's wild. I'm going to go down Pitamakan Pass a ways and see what the trail is like. especially in the mountains, I am drawn into his presence. As I sit here taking in the magnificent beauty of the creation around me, my heart sings with awe and wonder of God's mighty power, his unmatched wisdom and creativity.
Well, good morning. It's day three of our trip and uh, had a great night last night. Met some nice people. You always meet the nicest people, it seems like, on the trail and they've already cleared out. Wood is hanging out this morning. Had coffee already. We're gonna have some ramen noodles for breakfast this morning instead of oatmeal. Uh, got down last night to about 34 degrees. It was a little nippy out here, but just a beautiful morning, just glorious. We're gonna hike out today. It's about five miles back to the trailhead, all downhill, which is awesome. And uh, this is gonna be our last day out, but we've had just a great trip up here at No Name Lake and then going up through uh, Dawson Pass yesterday. You know, you have to be flexible. We didn't get to go to uh, through Pitamakan and down to Old Man Lake like we wanted to, but you can't control the grizzlies, that's for sure. So how did you sleep last night? Yeah. I had a hard time last night. What happened? My legs were aching. Just throbbing <laughs> that was a, up here. That was a heck of a hike yesterday. We went up 2,200 feet in 1.9 miles. And we've done a lot of hiking. We're at 32 miles in a week yeah. and uh, 7,200 feet in elevation gain. All right, your ramen is served. For breakfast. Ramen for, ramen's good any time. I just want something hot. You're shaking. I'm shaking it, trying to get oh. it. Oh. <laughs> trying to, to get Why it. Why are you shaking? I'm trying to get some noodles out of that. <laughs> Instead of all, you don't want all broth, do you? No. There you go. A little bit more broth and you can have the rest. Is that enough? Yeah, that's plenty. I'm just gonna eat straight out of the pot. That's good. Oh, that's hot. It's good. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> I said, get me my bear spray. And you're like, right you don't need front. your bear spray. I'm mean, right in front of you. I'm thinking, I don't care. What if it gets, I have to have my own protection too. Well, Dave and I were both standing right there. <laughs> I don't care. The bear spray out. <laughs> need my own. You know, it's crazy. Last year, we didn't see anything. Uh -uh. We were out 24 miles of backpacking and didn't see anything but a squirrel. And this year we've seen <laughs> bighorn sheep, goats, mountain goats. We've seen a black bear. And that met black bear is so cute. Right on the side of the trail. What a beautiful too. animal. Feathers are coming out. <laughs> That's what you call a freestanding tent.
best, best backpacking adventure or what? <laughs> it was awesome. I loved it. But I am so hungry. I'm starving to death. How about pizza time and brownie? That was the best pizza I think I've ever eaten. How about that Mexican restaurant in East Glacier, Serrano's? Well, I really want some pizza. Well, I really want Mexican. Come on. Well, I guess they're just going to have to stay tuned to find out where we end up eating, aren't they? <laughs> I guess so. Well, as you can see, this is chips and salsa, so I guess she won again. The Serrano. Mm. Oh, that's good. East Glacier. Gotta come here if you're here. Serrano is awesome. Really, really, really good food. Yes, good it is. service. Last year we came here after we did our 24 mile backpacking trip in Two Medicine and it, the burrito was giant and it was awesome. It was Great so hungry. Oh, so good. I still would rather have the pizza, I think. <laughs> this is second best. This is good. She always wins. After 40 years of marriage, she would think I would have won something. Good stuff. Oh, spicy. Remember this, happy wine, happy life, guys. <laughs> Keep <That's her> true. <laughs> All right. East Glacier, Serrano's Mexican restaurant. There it is. So good. Karen and I would like to thank you for joining us on our adventure to Dawson Pass. It was a spectacular day of hiking and the scenery was magnificent. I also want to encourage you to be watching in 2023 as we'll be sharing more of our journeys next year. God bless.